For question 22, here they tell us that Mrs. Tan is 32 years old. Okay. And we have the son here that is 5 years old. You are given the age of the two individuals there. So, the first thing is the focus, okay? The difference in the age. What is the difference in age? What is the difference? 32 minus 5. Alright, so 32 minus 5, we get a 27. Okay. And the question now asks, in how many years' time will she be four times as old as the sun? So, in how many years' time we are talking about future? Mrs. Tan will be four times. In other words, Mrs. Tan will be for you. Whereas the sun will only be one you. So where should I put the 27? In the middle. Between the Between. Three units. Three units. The three units. Why? When we talk about difference in age, right? It is this part here. The extra part that is bulging out that is considered the difference. So our three units here will be the 27. And you can check, right? Divide up, will you get the whole number? Then you will kind of like roughly know whether you're on the right track or not. So 27 divided by 3, it's a 9. So 9 means that it's the sun's age in future. But the sun is only 5 years old now. So, from 5 to get to 9, how many years will that be? So, 9 minus 5, it's a 4. So, a final answer, it's a 4. So, if you want to check your work, you can always take Mrs. Tan, who is 32 now, plus the 4 to get 36. 36, if you divide by 4, will you come back to this 9? Yes. So, you will know that you are actually on the right track. So, just remember, in each question, difference does not change. Okay? So, each question, the focus is most of the time all on the difference in the age. Okay?